That was like 50 spin cycles in a row. Going the resistance high. The wind blowing at you. Headwind. Hey, I'm gonna roll a world traveler, food lover. Taiwan is one of my favorite travel destinations, and last fall I had the chance to cycle around the country with my partner in photo shoots, Sylvia. This trip was a great way to experience all that Taiwan has to offer and challenge ourselves by doing something we'd never done before. From breathtaking views to the freshest seafood and bubble tea every day, and the occasional booch. Booch it! Booch! <laughs> this was our trip to Taiwan. You ready? Okay, Welcome to day three. We're stretching. I'm also trying to lose a little bit of weight, so I'm gonna sweat it out, which is why I'm wearing a jacket right now. So today we're exploring the Northern Ring Road. It is a hot day, but it's also an extremely windy day. And it was always working against us. Like yeah. it was never pushing why us Why could we forward? never cycle with the wind? We were always cycling against, against it. Against it. It was, it was a hard, it was really hard. Yeah, nothing could be easy. Woo! Going uphill. So this trail was absolutely stunning. It really actually felt like we were on an island. Yeah, we were next to the water, there were beaches, trees, and these giant turbines. So fun fact about me, I actually have a fear of extremely tall objects. And these wind turbines, we were so close to them, I was not comfortable. We are so close to those turbines. It's so cool, this path is amazing. You looked perfectly fine. You were like cycling around it and like, yeah. little did I no. know that you were. I was dying inside. So we're here at 0932999777. And uh, we're following the Judy. Follow the Judy, Judy. <laughs> so they led us to this super secret scenic spot and it was absolutely stunning. Yeah, beautiful blue water, waves crashing everywhere. Mm -hmm. This is blowing my mind. And this made it the perfect location for yet another photo shoot. shoot. So we kept holding up the group with all of our photo shoots. Yeah. But they just kind of knew us as the two that are gonna disappear and come back. So they didn't really Trail wait. behind a couple <laughs> kilometers. Apologies to the group, but. Uh, we got some really great good photos, photos from yeah. it. So what are your thoughts on seafood at this point in the trip? Well, I thought I had eaten everything in the sea, but. This was the day that they introduced some new dishes that we'd never seen before, like shrimp with sprinkles. Like birthday sprinkles. Yeah. And we had the creamy lobster sandwich. Yeah, and a thing called trilobite. A little freaky looking. I was not about it. Not ready to try low bite. of it. So, here we are. <laughs> so we're at the point in the day where I'm starting to get a little tired. And we were full from lunch yeah, and a little grumpy, I'm a, not gonna lie. A little loopy too. I never knew where we were. Oh, these old villages are so peaceful. And it's really just a reminder of how far we've come. I think he's so tired that he's focused. He can't, focused. Think he can't even anymore. think. So Pongu is full of natural beauty, and today we saw a ton of their landmarks. There was the famous oldest banyan tree. Mm -hmm. There were the famous cliffs. And there was the famous lighthouse. Is this what happens on a small island? Like every single thing is automatically famous. Yes, including Vivian, now. All right, leave it up to us to make friends with the owner of a restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going back. Yeah. For bubble tea again at Tea Pro. Yeah. Vivian is so awesome. Love her. She instantly felt like a friend mm -hmm. that we could not always communicate with. So I was trying to ask her if she had this picture book and she pulled out her phone. 
She pulls out her phone, she shows us an amazing bubble tea. I'm like, I want that one. But she thought I wanted the image. Literally, she to wanted send to transfer me the, the image. image. She showed us a picture of the menu item, and she thought we just wanted the picture. Thank you. Yeah, look at those. So we survived another day of cycling, tons of highlights, and the best way to cap off the day was Bubble Tea and Vivian. I miss her. Me too. If you're watching, Vivian. Next Friday on Go to Rolla. All right, we're saying bye. Bye, Vivian. Bye. We love you. Cheers. Is it crispy? It's not crispy. Know. You're gonna rip your pants. Listen, I already ripped my boots on this trip. So we attempted a photo shoot. I'm not the person to know how to handle with this too because they look so cool and they're like confident. Hey, everyone. Dedicate a lot of time. Hey, everyone. Hey.